In this video, I'm going to show you how to embed your YouTube playlist on your Divi website. To do this, we'll be using the Smash Balloon YouTube Feed Pro plugin, which lets us create fast and responsive YouTube feeds like this in just a matter of minutes without any coding needed. I'll be demonstrating using the pro version of the plugin, but you can check out the free version through the WordPress repository, but with less features. To purchase and download YouTube Feed Pro, head over to smashballoon.com, and once purchased, you can find your download link and license key for the plugin inside your Smash Balloon account. Download YouTube Feed Pro and head over to your WordPress dashboard. Now inside your dashboard, on the left hand side, hover over plugins and click on add new. Then go click on upload plugin at the top and upload the zip file for YouTube Feed Pro, like this, and click install now. Once installed, go click on activate plugin. And there we go, YouTube Feed Pro has now been installed and activated. But before we can create our YouTube playlist feed, let's go and activate the license key for the plugin. On the left-hand side, you'll now notice YouTube Feed. Hover over it like this and click on Settings. Here, beside License Key, go ahead and paste the license key from your Smash Balloon account, like this, and click Activate. And now the plugin has been activated, so we can begin creating our YouTube playlist feed. Once again, on the left-hand side, under YouTube Feed, go click on All Feeds. Next, click on Add New at the top to get started. With the YouTube Feed Pro plugin, you can create a variety of different feed types. For instance, you can create a feed of videos from any YouTube channel, a feed of videos from any playlist, a feed of videos that you favorited, and more. Since we want to embed a YouTube playlist inside our Divi website, let's go with the playlist feed type and click Next. And now it's asking us to enter our YouTube API key. I've already got mine ready, but if you want to learn how to create one for yourself, you can click on the video tutorial on the top right corner of your screen, or follow our written guide which you can find in the description of this video. Once you have your API key, paste it in the box like this, and click Add. And for our next step, we'll have to add a playlist ID for the playlist we want to display on our website. And for this tutorial, this is the playlist I want to display inside my website. And all you have to do here is at the top, go ahead and copy everything after PL, just like this. And back inside the plugin, you can paste it here and click Next. And for our final step, we'll have to select the template for the layout of our feed. We have options like the default, carousel, cards, list, and more. With these templates, you can create beautiful feeds without needing any design skills. For this tutorial, I'm going to go with the cards template and click Next. And just like that, we have a beautiful preview of your new YouTube playlist feed. Inside the feed, you'll find all the latest videos inside that playlist. We can now go and embed this on our Divi webpage, but before we do that, let me show you how we can customize your feed. On the left-hand side, under the Customize tab, go into Feed Layout. Inside, you'll find several options to modify the layout of your feed. At the top, under Layout, you'll notice we currently have the grid layout selected, which displays your videos in rows and columns. Next, we have the gallery layout, which displays the first video inside the playlist at the top, followed by the rest of the videos in a grid. And third, we have the list layout, which displays your YouTube playlist in a single column list. And lastly, we have the carousel layout, which displays the videos inside your playlist in a carousel view, which you can swipe through just like this. For this tutorial, I'm going to stick with the grid layout. And if you look below, you'll find options to modify the number of columns you display inside your feed. Currently, we're displaying three columns, but if you want to change that, all you have to do is enter the number of columns you want to display. And instantly, that change will be made inside the live preview on the right hand side. I'm going to change that back to three. And underneath that, you can also choose how many posts you want to show initially inside your feed. Currently, we're showing nine posts. But if you want to change that, all you have to do is enter the number of posts you want to display. And once again, that change will be made inside the live preview. And once you're happy with the layout of your YouTube playlist feed, click on save on the top right corner. Next, if you want to modify the color palette of your YouTube feed, under the customize tab, go click on color scheme. At the top, you can see that currently we've got inherit from theme selected, which means that the plugin will create your feed to automatically match the design of your WordPress theme. Next, we have a light theme, a dark theme, or even a custom theme that allows you to select the exact colors you want for your feed, just like this. And once you're happy with the color scheme, make sure to hit save on the top right corner. Lastly, if you want to only display specific videos on your feed, go into the settings tab and click on filters and moderation. Inside this menu, you can add words to hide or show videos containing those words. And at the bottom, you can enter video IDs to hide specific videos from your feed. With these options, you have complete control over the videos you display inside your YouTube playlist feed. And if you added any filters, make sure to click save on the top right corner. Now that you know how to create and customize your YouTube playlist feed, let me show you how we can embed it on your Divi website. To embed it, go click on embed on the top right corner. Next, copy your dedicated shortcode for the feed and click on add to a page. Select the page you want to add your feed to and click add. And now inside Divi Builder, click on the plus icon here and search for the code module. It's this one here. If I click on it, that will add the code module into my page and on the left hand side, I can paste the shortcode that I copied earlier like this. And after I click on the green button here, you'll notice a live preview of your new YouTube playlist feed inside your Divi web page. We can now save our page and check it out on our live website. And here we are now on our live Divi web page and right in the middle, we have our brand new YouTube playlist feed. All the videos from our YouTube playlist are displayed inside this fast and responsive feed. And at the bottom, if we click on load more, it will load even more videos directly inside your Divi web page. And if a site visitor wants to watch any of these videos, they can click on it like this 
and that video will open up inside a beautiful live box view which allows site visitors to watch your videos directly from your website. You now know how to create and customize a beautiful YouTube playlist feed for your Divi website. If you have any questions about what I covered in this video, please let me know in the comments down below. If you have any technical issues, please contact your awesome support team. They'd be happy to help you out. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to learn about social media marketing tips to help you grow your business. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.